Yes, it is a bit laggy, but you can't really ask much from a non-Android simple Samsung TV. So for a non-Android simple TV, this is pretty cool. Yep. Hey, what is going on everybody and thank you so much for watching. In this tutorial, I'll teach you two methods you can screen mirror your iPad to your Samsung non-Android TV. Yep, non-Android. Yeah, okay. So the first thing you want to do is to make sure your iPad is connected to uh, your uh, Wi-Fi connection because we do need a uh, free app to download. Okay, so this is method number one. We'll be doing method number two in a little bit, but I just wanted to start off with a, a simple method. So just download a free app called iMediaShare and it's really simple. Just, I've done this before. <laughs> I'll just update the app just for the video. Okay, so once the app is downloaded, you don't have to do anything on your iPad. Let's just jump right to the TV. Okay, so this is a really old TV of mine. I've been using it for a while now. I've done this before, so if you have never done this before, just go to the network settings and connect your uh, TV to your uh, to your Wi-Fi connection. Now here you can also use your iPad hotspot if you have one. You can also use uh, uh, Ethernet cable if you want to. That's, that's also an option. So. Once, the, once your TV is connected to the uh, Wi-Fi connection and your iPad is connected to the same Wi-Fi connection, now it's time to do the mirroring. Okay, so this is method number one. It's going to be pretty simple compared to the method number two. So once you open the app, I open the iMedia Share for the first time, it'll ask you for for, per, for some permissions. Just click access and uh, you know, and you know the normal stuff. Okay, so once you are on this menu, you'll see multiple options like photos, videos, music. Uh, social network as well. So this is all the options that you you get. You can mirror anything you like. So okay. So just for an example, I'll I'll just go to the photos and show you how it's done. So just once once you're in the photos, you have uh, options to select from an album. I'll select a uh, let's see. Okay, I, I see a really cool cat picture that I really really love. So okay. Once you click on the uh, once you click on anything like just this is just an example but if you click on anything it will ask you for it will ask you to connect to what tv okay so in this case i have samsung tv right behind me and that's that's what i want to connect it to so you might have multiple tvs you know <laughs> yeah it happens but now find your tv and just click on it and once you click on it for the first time it'll give you a tutorial like a really simple tutorial to just how to use the app and stuff just click this dismiss at the bottom and it will automatically connect start connecting to your uh, tv so since this is a really old tv it will ask you for permissions so just click allow and uh, that should be fine so once you click allow and that's pretty much it as you can see it's kind of mirrored it's completely wireless and completely free so yeah you can you can you can do literally whatever you like okay so now that let's head to the method number two so method number two is going to be more literal in a literal sense that we're going to be mirroring our ipad completely to our uh to our samsung non-android simple tv okay so this is really awkward but you have to download a free app called screen mirroring app link will be in the description box below and it's really weird that you really need to type tv to download it okay so once the app is downloaded and open the app and that's pretty much it you'll see some weird stuff that you really don't need to do anything just Keep it there and let's just jump right to our, our TV. So this is this is more of a literal method, so it's gonna be pretty hard. I mean, not as hard, but it's gonna be really difficult for some people. So uh, just go to the Smart Hub of, on your Samsung TV or any TV that has a Smart Hub. In this case, I have a Smart Hub, it's pretty old. It has like, you know, I don't know, limited applications and stuff. So just open the Smart Hub on your, uh, on your TV and just specifically open a web browser. Now you can use Chrome, you can use any browser that you have on your TV and just go to the URL uh, as you can see, as you are seeing on the screen, just t type tv.app, really simple. Any browser will work. In my case, I have the Samsung default browser and once you, once you open the website, you will see a code. Now you can also scan it you scan the barcode on the on the website, but all or or you can also use the code manually. So I'm gonna use the code manually. Let's just let me just give me give me like five seconds to type it. It's UJ54, and uh, let's see what's on the TV. It's Y. It's Y1. Okay. Once you find the once you type the code, click connect. It will it will give you an option to go buy it or watch an ad. I I suggest just watch the ad. And also you have, you might have to like wait a couple of seconds. And once you have watched the ad, just close the ad 
and you you have multiple options again but this time it's connected to your tv okay so now once you are on this screen just click on screen mirror just click on screen mirror and it will automatically connect your uh okay now once you click on it it will ask you to start broadcasting just start click on start broadcast it will take three seconds and that's pretty much it okay so it might ask you for permissions on your tv it might not it might not ask you but since my tv is really 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 old so it is asking me so i'll just click on show all and uh let's just wait okay once i click show all it is connected to the tv so it is a bit laggy yes sure but you can't really ask much from a non android simple samsung tv and you're you screaming your ipad to your tv completely for your cost and you can do whatever you like so this is it for me thank you so much for watching and uh, also I'll, I'll show you how to disconnect in a bit and uh, yeah that's pretty much it so this is it for me i'll see you in the next video if this video helped please uh please please feel free to subscribe as i'll show you i'll, I'll see you i'll see you in the next i'll see you in the next one okay peace out